Hello, we're going to do a quick lesson on angles using a protractor. So get your notepad, take some notes, and enjoy. All right, we're going to talk about angles. There are three angles that you need to know. We have acute, obtuse, and a right angle. An acute angle is 89 degrees or less, which I'm going to demonstrate in the, with a protractor in a minute. Obtuse is an angle that's 91 degrees or wider. And a right angle is 90 degrees exactly. Usually whenever there's a right angle, you'll see the little box there, and that means right angle. I'm going to show you the protractor. And okay, over here we have a protractor. It's used to measure angles. Uh, right now, it is going very close to the big number up there is a 140. Let me zoom in. Okay. And then the smaller number is a 40. It's just, it's like not right on it, but very close. For the sakes of this uh, discussion, we'll just say that it's right on there. Now, in this case, you have two angles. You have this angle right over here, and you have this angle right over here. This angle is the sharper one, which would make it an acute angle, 89 degrees or less. So, would I use the 140? or would I use the 40? In this case, it's the, this is the acute angle. This angle here is 40 degrees. This angle here is 140 degrees, making it an obtuse angle. A right angle is exactly 90 degrees. There's a right angle here, and there's a right angle here as well. These numbers, the, the Adding both angles up together will always add up to 180 because a, a straight line is considered a 180 degree angle. So, right now we have an acute angle. Let me see, do you think for acute, will we use the 120 or the 60? Okay, an acute angle would be the smaller one, so that's a 60, which means that the obtuse angle is 120. 120 plus 60 equals 180. 180 here, you got 180 there. They're always gonna, they're always going to add up to 180. So over here, we have this one would be your acute angle because it's less than 90, uh, less than 89 degrees, and it's an 80 degree angle, while the obtuse angle is 100, uh, 100 degrees. 100 plus the 80 is 180. It will always add to 180. I hope this kind of helps you understand angles a little bit better. Try practicing some. You can look up online. <laughs>